Kevin Holland landed some strikes in round one, but Vittori got a takedown later in the round. He also got a takedown in round two and landed strikes. Holland's eyes started to swell up. Vittori dominated a lot of round three on the ground. Vittori got a takedown in round four and got Mount off another takedown. And he got a takedown in round five to get the unanimous decision victory. Arnold Allen drops Sadiq Yusuf with a left hand in round one and a left kick in round two on route to a unanimous decision victory. He has now won 10 straight fights. Julian Marquez dropped Sam Alvey and then choked him unconscious in round two. Nina Nunes, formerly known as Nina Ansra, got taken down by Mackenzie Dern, mounted, and then eventually armbarred 448 into the fight. Dern's gonna be ranked number five after this win. When she gets her opponents to the ground, it's usually big trouble. Joe Selecki pulled guard versus Jim Miller and lost the first round because of it, so he decided to get a takedown in round two and won that round, and he did that again in round three. He picks up the unanimous decision and now has won six in a row. Amazingly, this was Jim Miller's 37th fight in the UFC, which is a UFC record. Mateusz Gamrot had a good first round versus Scott Holtzman, and then he knocked him out in round two to improve to 18 wins, one loss, and a no contest. Charges Dano tried to grapple with Jorgen De Castro, but ended up knocking him out cold with a right hand 302 into the fight. This is the first time he's fought since 2016. Jack Shore went to split decision over Hunter Azure and improves his undefeated record to 13 0. Luis Saldana wins a decision over Jordan Griffin. The judges gave him the first and third rounds. 